Well, hello, my loves. Are you guys ready for a grocery haul? Um, we spent roughly $400 at Walmart today. That sounds absurd, but we went to two different Walmarts. Um, because we went to the Walmart further away first. It's in one direction. And then I heard that the Walmart closer in the other direction had some Squishmallows on clearance for $5 because they had way too many of them. And so the first Walmart we went to did not. So we went back to that Walmart and I got each of my kids a Squishmallow for five bucks. Those aren't gonna be in this video because they've got them right now. My two older ones are home from school because it's teacher and service day. So you're not gonna see that. Uh, those uh and that's after taxes before taxes it was like 375 or 80 dollars um so you're not gonna see the squishmallows but uh are we ready to get started um we got two gallons of milk i'm only gonna show you one because i didn't want to get the other one out of the fridge need it a gallon of oil. Um, I got these. I'm showing all the things that aren't in bags first because before we went to the second Walmart, because we had to drive through our town to get to the second Walmart, I stopped and put the cold stuff in the fridge. So I got two of these. Um, I use these to cook steaks in. I use them. What did I? I bought. Bu uh, mm, I bought these for a reason. What was I making? I don't know. There's a video of it on my channel. I can't remember what it is I make. It was make maybe it was the salmon. I can't remember. But I just got two of them. I like having those on hand. Uh, potatoes. We eat a lot of potatoes in this house. Uh, 24 pack of Dr. Pepper because right now Walmart is the cheapest place to get it. Um, we got cat litter. This isn't the one we usually get, but it is the corn cob litter that our cat litters. Um, and, but both Walmarts have been out of our. Uh, both Walmarts have been out of the litter we normally get, so we just got that one. Okay. That seems to be everything that is no longer in a bag. Well, besides this chicken, we got some chicken thighs. This is our preferred chicken right now. Yes, there's a bag stuck to this because somehow the sticker came off on the bag. And, uh, yeah. But it was thirteen oh one for four and a half pounds-ish. Not too bad. Um, got an avocado. Because um, we're going to have burgers one day. I got two things of my chocolate chip cookies. Um, we got some uh, 93 7 ground beef for burgers. I just prefer using a less fatty um, bur uh, hamburger for that because it doesn't shrink as much. Because there's not as much fat. Okay. Also, I got two bricks of Parmesan because I'm making a chicken and rice casserole this week that I'm going to film for you guys. I do have the macaroni filmed. I just got to film the outro and edit it and put it up so it'll probably go up in the next few days. I'm always doing so good posting two videos a week and then this last week it just kind of, there's been a lot going on. So, but two things of Parmesan. That's it for that bag. I'm going to try and do... You know what? No, I'm not. Because we don't... We don't do that here. I was going to try and organize it between food and non-food, but you guys all know. That's not how we roll here. I just grab shit and show it. Oh, excuse my French. I'm sorry. I just grab stuff and show it. So, here we go. Tater tots. Extra crispy fast food fries. Browns O'Brien. Like I said, we like potatoes. Pizza rolls. If you know, you know. What's going on over here? Oh. Got some salmon. 
Yes, did I spend $8 on this bacon? Yes, I did. It's not a lot of money to spend on some bacon. Yes, it is. But my husband, he really likes thick bacon, and it's for his burger. So I figured, why not? So we got some extra thick bacon. Got some Gouda. Got some Kobe Jack. Got some sliced jalapeno and habanero jack. And, of course. If you've been watching for the last few weeks, we have our Wagyu steak. Not on sale. This was $17.80. That's what my husband's fixing to have for lunch as soon as I get done filming this. We've got a sausage and gravy breakfast bowl. That's for my daughter. We've got a steak and eggs breakfast bowl. That's for my husband. We got a meat lovers breakfast bowl. That is for my seven-year-old. And then we got... These new by Stouffer's Ultimate Five Cheese Mac. My husband's been liking this as like his dinner on nights that I close and he doesn't cook. Well, he does cook on nights that I close, I promise. But some nights he doesn't and he prefers these for dinner while he makes the kids like chicken nuggets and french fries or something. Um, so those are for him. Um, we were running low on ramen. Uh, we don't usually buy this very often because we don't eat it very often, but... I think I only got like two or three packs left, so it was time to stop it. We're going to try this hamburger helper, just another easy meal. Um, if you've been around for a long time, you know this is a recent thing. We usually don't. We, uh, well, in the past, we usually didn't do hamburger helper. What, bud? I love you. Look, I yeah, no, Go. Go out. Go out, please. Nope, that way. Back to your room, please. Thank you. I appreciate you. Uh, within, like, the last, since August, really, when my husband became a stay-at-home parent, we started doing these just as easy meals for him to cook. Um, Pop-Tarts, also something that we've slowed down on buying because all of my kids have been enjoying eating cereal for breakfast on the weekends when they are home. They usually, the older two usually eat breakfast at school. And Luca has also started eating breakfast at school, so we slowed down on buying these, but we needed more. Okay, what's in this bag? Oh, it was time for new toothbrushes, so we got these ones for the boys. Katie is a little bit too big for these, my nine-year-old, so she got this one. Uh, and then me and Zach tr are trying these bamboo ones. They were on clearance for two twenty-five. I mean, it can't be that bad, right? Helps brighten teeth and fight bad breath. Well, isn't that all toothbrushes? Like, is it specifically just bamboo? Like, what? I'm not really sure what the point of a bamboo toothbrush is, but they were on clearance. So, I can't even show them to you because they're wrapped up in this. Uh, I can already tell you my husband's going to think the bristles are too soft, probably. But, $2.25 for those. Luca is the only one who use, still uses the kids' toothpaste, but he was running out, so we we'll need some more of that. Uh, we got some Motrin because we were running low. Nobody is sick right now, but I'd rather have it now instead of waiting until somebody is sick. Um, I got these for my face. These weren't on the list, but I got them. I couldn't even tell you how much they are. They were, I think they were like four bucks. Not too bad, but they're for exfoliating, massaging, and cleansing your face, so... I just really don't like how they call that massaging nubs. I don't know why that really irks me, but it does. Anyways. And then I got, let's see, one, two, three, four tank tops. They were on clearance for a dollar, so I just got one in every color that they had. Uh, I usually wear these for, like, sleep or just around the house. Um, let's see, what else is in here? Oh. Uh, I got some mascara. I have black, but I just really have been wanting brown mascara, so I got brown mascara. Um, I got a charcoal face cleanser because, you know, gotta wash my face. Um, what else? What else we got in here? What else? Oh, my husband's Sasquatch soap. They came out with two new scents. I really like this coconut castaway. It's really good. This uh, summer citrus one isn't too bad, but I prefer the coconut castaway, but we got those two. 
And then let's see what we got here. We got some mini peanut butter M&M's and then just regular M&M minis. Uh, I think one for each of the kids. I don't know. My husband put those in the cart, so. Um, let's see what's in here. Oh, this is the one that had stuff in it that fell out, so there's only one thing. Parsley for the chicken casserole thing that I'm going to be making. Um, let's see, we got four of Katie's water. She still has like two or three left in there, but we got a blue raspberry. We got a mandarin orange. We got a orange and, and cream. And a pineapple coconut. Some Epsom salt. This is a new one, at least at my Walmart. Probiotic lemon bath and essential oils. Oh no. Just a new one. I haven't tried yet, but I thought it would be fun. And then uh, we needed some paper bowls. We use these for the kids, like after school snacks and stuff. Um, and then paper plates. I know I have gained a few new subscribers in the last week, like, in the, well, in the last month, I think I've gained, like, 18-ish. Um, don't come for me for using paper plates and bowls. Like, I'm a full-time working mom. My husband is a stay-at-home dad to three kids. We like to do whatever makes our lives easier. Um, yeah. So, paper plates, guys. Um, are we really down to, like, the last four or five bags? Six bags? Um, I got some garlic. I usually prefer to buy this at Sam's because it's a much better deal, but I'm not going to Sam's anytime soon, and I'm almost out. So, I just bought this. This was like five bucks, and the big giant one that you usually see me take out for my cooking videos is also like five bucks at Sam's, and it's like three times the amount, but it is what it is. Um, we got two cans of sweet peas. And two cans of the cut green beans, because my kids will eat this one, these ones. They won't eat the French cut ones, which are my favorite, which makes me a little sad, but whatever. Whatever I have to do to get them to eat vegetables. I feel like I'm missing something. We'll see how we feel when we get to the end. The kids picked up these cookie bite cereal for themselves. And then, because I did have to take my older two with me, which I try not to do. But. And then we got mini spooners for my husband. Those are his favorite. We got some body oil gel. We got some. Oh, my kids needed some new shampoo and stuff. And this is three in one. But we don't use it as 3-in-1, they just use it on their hair, and then we use uh, regular body wash on their bodies, but it's hard to find for kids just a 2-in-1, it's always 3-in-1, so we just use this. Um, what else is here? Oh, let's go along with the brown mascara. If any of y'all are wondering when I wear makeup, like what I use, uh, I can tell you if you want to know, like I could do a video, I guess, if you want, that's not really my vibe. But I can do a video showing you. Um, this is the same exact mascara I use, I have been using, but the one I already own is in black. This one is in brown. And then this is also the current eyeliner that I use. I just have it in black, and this one is in brown because I want to wear brown. Because I'm an adult and I can do what I want. Okay. Let's see, we got chicken broth also for that castle. And then we got rice, also, for that casserole. And then we got applewood smoked bacon mashed potatoes. Hey! I got two of those. Um, I got two different types of hamburger buns. Why? Because we're doing hamburgers one night, and we're doing chicken sandwiches the next night, like, uh, fried chicken sandwiches, and, uh, we're weird, and we like to use different types of buns for those, so, we got these, Brio the this brand of brioche buns with the sesame seeds on them for hamburgers, and then we got 
these brioche hamburger buns for uh, without the sesame seeds for the chicken sandwiches. And I believe this is the last bag. Uh, I got me some pulp free orange juice and some pineapple juice. I enjoy this. Oh no! I'm sad. Man, I'm sad. I just realized this is light orange juice. Who cares? Hopefully it doesn't taste like roast. You won't even taste it. And then last but not least, shaving cream. Shaving cream. I know that four hundred dollars for all this seems like a lot. But it's really not a lot. Like, I know the cat litter was like $15. My uh, Dr. Pepper was like $13. Freaking. Each of these things were like $9 or $10. So, you know, it seems like a lot. And it is a lot, but it is what it is. Uh, yeah. So, the price you pay. Also for convenience, because a lot of these convenience foods are not um, very cheap. Anyways, that's it for me today, guys. I love you guys, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!